So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in troubleshoot settings. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on other troubleshooters. Now you're gonna find network and internet. Click on run. And now this will come up. If it detects anything, it will try to fix it for you. For the second method, you're gonna head over to search and type in view network connections. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna find your network adapter. You're gonna double click on it. And then click on properties. And then click on internet protocol version four. And then once this comes up, make sure you have both the default options selected. Obtain an IP address automatically and obtain DNS server just automatically as well. You wanna select both of these options and then click on OK. See if that works for you. For the next method, you wanna head over to search again and type in CMD. Now you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once this comes up, you wanna type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. Click on enter. Now you're gonna type in NETSH space Winsock space reset click on enter again. Now you just wanna restart your computer and then this should now fix your problem. 